So, <clears throat> I think this will be the last of the uh, weekly pointless minute reviews because um, yeah, they're pointless, aren't they? Absolute dribble. Um, they just, I don't know. don't even know why I did it. You can't really say anything, can you? So, yeah. Ironically, this little list I've decided to end it with is um, probably has even less detail than some of the best influencers out there. I wouldn't have got that far. But yeah, I've just sort of thought I'd go for fragrances, really popular fragrances I don't actually own. And um, yeah, kind of an unpopular opinion of them, I guess. That's nearly taking me a minute. So first up is Aventus. Um, don't own it, never will. Why would I? It's 453 million clones of it, which really smell more like the original than the different batches of Aventus and they're about 200 quid cheaper and what have you so yeah that's Aventus number two BR540 same kind of thing isn't it there's, there's, there's do you know what there's actually um, clones and inspired I actually do prefer because they're not as I don't know I mean if uh, kind of people call it latex gloves condoms you know burnt sugar it's kind of chokingly strong and oppressive endless DNA um, yeah that's BR540 uh, number 3 is um, of course Delina from Parfums de Mali um, people love it I mean again these are all subjective I'm not saying they're bad I'm just saying you know why the hell would I own them um, it's a very sharp rhubarb and shampoo um, you know I've got shampoo that does that job and if I really want to punish myself, I could eat some rhubarb, some real rhubarb, not synthetic. The Aki rhubarb, so that's a Parfums de Mali a Delina. Number four, well, Dior Sauvage has to be in here, doesn't it, really? Um, again, nothing personal against it, just, you know, um, it's like the Terminator taking a shower, isn't it? A bit of metallic shower gel and um, abrasive muskiness to, uh, to clean Arnie's muscles and uh, whatnot. Again, no, nothing, nothing wrong with it. It's popular for a reason. This doesn't work on me. And uh, finally, we'll end it with um, an issue of Zood for Greatness. I'm not sure in real life people ever go anywhere near a fragrance that's nearly 300 quid. That smells of chemical waste. Um, strong synthetic um, lavender and stuff. That lasts about 4,000 years. So yeah, this is a um, um, uh, weekly pointless minute review. Bowing out. Um, it's been fun. It hasn't really. It's just, it's pointless. Um, I'll probably come back with um, single reviews midweek if I get time. I'm a bit ahead with my, my usual videos. Anyways, it's a pointless ramble. Right, thanks folks. Bye. Oh, what sort of uh, fragrances do you kind of, you know, that should be loved, um, etc. Do you absolutely not gel with, that like you can't stand? Anyway, this is too quick, too long. Right, bye folks. Bye.